Five officers were killed in the attack on July, of July 7th, 2016. Two El Centro officers, John Abbott and Brian Shaw, were injured as the perpetrator shot through glass windows to gain entry into this building. July 7th, 2016 is now part of the 50-year history of our college. And while a year has passed, the horrific memories and emotional toll continues for many of us. I ask you to join me in a moment of silence for our fallen officers. So today, we remember the lost lives, the fathers, sons, brothers, uncles that did not make it home that evening. And those injured because of senseless violence. For me to be completely transparent on how I feel today regarding this occasion, it is of utter importance that we start just a few days prior to July 7th. I have the utmost respect for law enforcement, and I know that the service they contribute to help protect and serve our community is immeasurable. I also feel that everyone has to be held accountable for their choices and actions, whether you wear a uniform or not. We were all hurting. We all had experienced fear and loss. We all wanted individuals to be held accountable. We all wanted to feel as if we mattered. It's a shame that people tried to make you feel that you had to choose to mourn for one group, the slain officers, or the other, the slain citizens. Every life that is lived matters. The, the outpouring of support that we get from everybody, uh, the, the strength of the college and the community that's come back together again, the, the brotherhood that's, that we see with everybody that's here, whether it be the El Centro Police, Dallas Police, Dallas Fire Rescue, uh, Dallas Fire Department, any of that. 